Hello everybody and welcome back to Super Mario 64. In the last episode we finished off Big Boo's Haunt, course number 5. Down this way. But now we're going to go back down to the basement and head to course 6, which we've seen a part of already. The Hazy Maze Craze, I think is what it's called. And we will be trying to get all 6 stars in that level. This level is harder than... Um, than Big Boo's Haunt, but it is easier than the other two worlds in this area. Um, it's a maze, so it's a little bit hard. Swing, swimming beast in the cavern. This is, we go to the exact same place that we were in in the last episode, in the last time we were here. We're going this way this time instead of going right. That was a bad decision. We can already see two stars, just in... Oh crap, crap, crap! I'm dead. I'm alive! I'm alive! That should be possible. Okay. I see one up there and one way over there, but we'll get those uh, a little bit later. That's not the one we're going after right now. There's a bat. I don't think he'll come after me. Good, barely missed that boulder. Um, so we're gonna come down here. There's another one. So we've seen three stars already, and none of them are the I press control to dive, but it didn't do that much damage. It's okay. Okay. And there's a fourth star. Find and now see there she is. Hey, big girl. Okay, we're just gonna get on top of you. Oop, we're not. Okay. Oh, camera. Camera's being stupid. Okay. Make it. Make it. Make it. Ah, oh, son of a crap. Okay. Let's try that again. Behave this time, girl. Made it. Alright, and now we have 40 stars. We're exactly one third of the way done with the game. Which is pretty cool. Swimming beast in the cavern. And right back into the level. Four, elevate for eight red coins. Oh, I hate this mission. Hopefully, it, I don't do too bad. Okay, start off with three coins. We're not doing hundred coins yet. Hundred coins in this world is insanely hard. All the coins are actually in this one room. And when they say elevate, they mean elevate. We're going up in the air for all eight. Oh, that'd be really cool if I could triple jump. Okay. So you're gonna wanna get on this platform and go this way toward that wall. And then out this way. I've gotten all eight red coins a couple times in this level simply because I was trying to get 100 coins. And each one of these blocks here, these three blocks, has a red coin in it each. And that eyeball will shoot you, it's a pain. Okay. And the platform will whoa, stop. Will stop for you. Okay, we actually want to go back this way a little bit. And this way. Be careful of this. If you touch this at all, you will like slide off and it's really annoying. Okay, go back for it. Stop it. Okay, this is gonna get annoying, isn't it? Oh, freak. Okay, there we go. Okay, give me, give me life back, you stupid thing. Okay. 
Okay. Now, I don't know if there's a better way to get up here or whatnot. This is how I get not that way, so... I, do, I don't know if this is the right way to do it, but I do it a weird way. Okay. No, no. I long jump over to that wall. I don't know if that's the right way, but it's the way I do it. On this platform right here. Yeah. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah. Almost like fell and died. Well, I wouldn't die. But okay. Get on this thingy. Moving the platform. So this is the first double digit episode of Super Mario, the second let's play ever to make it this far. Oh crap, that thing doesn't stop moving, I forgot. Yeah, if you just follow that pathway, it'll give you the rest of the four coins. Now we have to worry about getting back up there. I feel like I'm doing this in like a really wrong... Uh, 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 son of a... Ooh. That was good. That was good. I broke the box, so I think I did. Did I just jump off, or what did I do? I'm not 100% sure. Okay, I broke the box. Okay, yeah, so there's one coin. You can see one in the distance over there. And then there's a platform where two more are resting on. The last two to get are easy. It was just to the right of the screen. If it was turned a little bit more, but oh. Now there are bats that start flying towards you. Go away, go away, go away, go away. Touch it. But okay. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go. Go away. Go away. Go away. No. That sucks. I hate those bats so much. Yeah. All the way back up. Just for two. Oh my gosh! Is there a better way to get... Really? Do I wall jump? Stop it. Stop turning the freaking camera angle! What the heck? It, like, went to the right. I don't even know how you're supposed to get up there, like... I feel like I'm doing it completely wrong way. But I don't... Don't you hit that switch, you stupid plumber. Okay, good. Hopefully I don't have to do this stupid pathway again. I really do not like this mission. As a whole is kind of annoying. This is the only really annoying mission, though. It's just a pain in the butt to get. The next couple, I think, are going to be quick and easy to get. We should be able to get all six stars. We're going to run a little over 20 minutes, I think, this episode, but whatever. I think we did a little bit last episode, but that was just because I knew Big Boo's haunt like the back of my hand. I know this one pretty well, too. The worlds in the basement are a lot uh, darker themed. Yeah, go away. Get stuck behind the wall. Good job. Okay. We should be in the clear now. I don't hear any more rustling of the stupid bats. Okay. Can we just change? Thank you. Awesome. We did it. Or I did it. You guys watched. Good job for watching. Just come over here <laughs> for the star. Here we go. That'll be for eight red coins. We got thirty coins. 
say, we haven't died in a while, but I think we died two episodes ago, so Metalhead Mario can move. Okay, I know where this one is. We have to go back to where the Loch Ness Monster is. I don't know if that's what it really is, that's what I call it. Oh! That was close. That's always nice. Okay. We'll come back for that star over there soon. Okay. Oh, wait. No, I need to go back up here. I need to be back up here. Okay. Good job, Mario. What you do is you kind of follow this lighter path of, um, I don't know, the ground, I guess, I don't know. And you're gonna come up here and hit that switch. Oh, let's, let's stay underwater so we can actually heal up. Okay, and now we're gonna go this way. Yeah, stupid, like, I don't know what these are called. Hey! Oh, what the? What the f- Die! Come here. Thank you. Oh, they respawn! They respawn! Okay. Long jump one. Up, 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 up. Okay, I hate long jumping. It's annoying. Sometimes it's just ground pound. And made it. Awesome. 42 stars. And we're halfway done with the hazy maze craze. Navigating the Toxic Maze. Okay. Now we're gonna go back to the room with eight red coins for this one. This one's fairly simple, if I remember correctly. There's a lot quicker way to get down, is just like fall and then kind of like throw yourself forward. Now, this part, this level is actually what gives the level its name. You have this gas that you want to stay out of. Watch out for the little shy guy gunner things, I don't know what they're called. Okay, let's go this way. Honestly, don't remember which way I'm supposed to go that way. Is this the right way? Down and play. I think this is the right way. There are actually two doors in that little stretch that I was in. I think this is right. Should be a star right here. Okay, there's a star. I don't know if it's the right one. But we're gonna go after it. You want to hold A when you're up here, too. Because you will, like, fall and die if you don't. It sucks too, I've fallen here, and it's like, oh crap. <laughs> Stop walking. <gasps> oh, thank you! I still died. <laughs> I thought I was saved, but nope, I wasn't. Okay. Some fancy flip work there. Navigating the toxic maze. About an hour and a half into my next class. Well, today's Wednesday, I'm recording on Wednesday, and Wednesday's also like the worst day for me for classes. Um, I have a class at 9, then 9.05 technically, and then 11.15, then 5.15, and then 6.55 to 8.55. It sucks. No. Silly Mario tricks for kids. Go away. Let's go see what the second door is, as I forget. Get out of there. Get out. Get out of this stupid pothole thing. 
Mario. Okay. Which way is this? Like, what's this way? This actually might be the right way. I was supposed to go. I'm not 100% sure. Hey, there's a star. We got a star. I don't know if it was the right one, but we got a star. <laughs> Was it the right one? It was! It was the right one! So you think he actually died or we got the wrong one? Okay. Amazing emergency exit. Okay, I think this is the one where, like, you have to crawl in those little fence things. Is there a way on top of those, I wonder? Because that'd be a lot easier to get to the star. probably get there without getting the metal cap, but that's risky. I mean, I try getting down that hole without getting hurt, without, like, bumping into anything. Oh. I'd probably be at three health right now. Two health. Yeah, it's... Just get the metal cap, it's safer. <laughs> I'd be dead perfectly, and then I have to make it through here without getting hurt, really. Now I have full health. Okay. So this is the emergency exit the game is talking about. So this is the fourth star, right? Yeah, the fourth star. So I should be able to get all, all six stars before this episode's up. Okay, is there... No, there's not. Okay. Okay, that's a, not a safe way to do that. Okay, stay out of Mario first person view and just stick with the Lakitu camera. So you get a bird's eye view of this thing. And I'm safe. And that is 44 stars. Here we go! And we got one of the stars in that big room there. And now it's going for star number 45. Watching for rolling rocks. Okay. Like I said, we want to go back to that big room with the big boulders. Hence the name and level of the star. You basically just don't get hit by the rocks and make it up this pathway. You can get hit by the rocks, doesn't matter. It's not. What the heck, really? It falls on top of my head. So, what you want to do is come up to this door and just wall jump up to the right platform. If you go over there, what's over there? Nothing's over there. But over here is star number six for the course. Here we go! And there we go. We are done with course six. Hazy Maze Craze. And that is it for this episode. In the next episode, we will either be tackling this level, Letha Lava Land, or this level. I'm not going to tell you who that is, because it's, it's hiding itself, so I'm going to keep it a secret what it is. I will find out which course is next, and we'll let you know in the next episode. Tune in tomorrow for another episode of Pokemon White version 2, and tune in for two more days and so to watch the next episode of this. Don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.